In this video, you'll learn how to install and run New TTS Air, an AI voice cloning and TTS system that can generate natural, expressive voices. I'm testing on New TTS Air. Hope you enjoy. Before we start, make sure you have requirements. First, we access the Hugging Face page that I commented below. Click on Run Locally. Copy to CMD as in video. Now we will create virtual environment on Python 3.10. Then activate the virtual environment. We will check the submodule and update so that the repository can update the latest resources. Now we will install the requirements. We will install PIP spaces packages. Now we will uninstall the old torch library. We go to the official PyTorch page. I will check what version my CUDA toolkit is on. Then copy the prompt on PyTorch and edit it accordingly. Now we will run the app. If anyone has eSpeak error, do as I say. Uninstall Phonomizer and install another version. Now we will run again. We have launched successfully. I will guide you to create a bat file. To launch next time, you create a text file in the root folder. Please type like in the video. I will also leave the content in the description. Change.txt to .bat. Now I will demo to show you how Newt's Air works. First, we will try to create with available template. So I'm live on radio and I say, well, my dear friend James here clearly, and the whole room just froze. Turns out I'd completely misspoken and mentioned our other friend. My name is Dave and um, I'm from London, duh. I will try with my file. Welcome to MuseFlow AI. Welcome to MuseFlow AI. I'm testing on new TTS Air. Hope you enjoy. Welcome to MuseFlow AI. I'm testing on new TTS Air. Hope you enjoy. That's it. 
you've successfully installed new TTS Air. Subscribe for more tutorials on AI tools.